Welcome back to another video. So when you think about Tesla, you think about the most powerful EV company in the world. But what if I tell you that there are some competitors, especially companies in the US, that wanna give Tesla a run for its money? So we're gonna definitely talk about a lot of the Silicon Valley electric car companies out there. Like they're cool and all, but keep in mind, the majority of those EV companies and startups do not have factories. My big gripe is if you don't have a factory, your shares will not grow, and even if your shares do grow, there will be a huge drastic decline. You must have a factory to back yourself up. No matter how cool of a car you can make, if you don't have a factory, you can't have any sales. So if we check out DPHC or Diamond Peak Holdings, now this is a SPAC, and I get it, SPACs are honestly pretty crazy. But check out this guy, it's up 30%. Went from 14 bucks all the way up to the peak of like $19. It did drop a little bit, but it has stabilized. In fact, it doesn't really want to go down all that much, which is honestly pretty crazy. So DPHC is gonna be merging with Lordstown Motors. Now keep in mind that these guys have already made a couple of these cars and they look absolutely fantastic. It's like this EV truck fully electric and it does look very very nice lordstown motors is said to be the next big tesla not because of its vehicles but they actually have a factory which is the former gm plant and right now this is 6.2 million square feet of working space in america so it is pretty big it's already capturing the attention of a lot of politicians and right now lordstown motors will be retrofitting the brand new gm factory into a brand new electric workstation and start cranking out these cars and keep in mind that the truck will be the first vehicle on sale. You can honestly pre-order if you want to. And afterwards, they're honestly thinking about making sedans, maybe other SUVs. They could be like the biggest rival to Rivian, which is backed by Ford and Amazon, and also the biggest rivals against Tesla. Just give it a couple years. And Lordstown Motors is extremely big, especially how it's also backed up by GM. So it's honestly kind of funny that Lordstown Motors bought out the GM factory, and now they're actually getting a huge you know, backing and also a huge boost from GM themselves. So right now, DPHC or Diamond Peak Holdings, Lordstown Motors, however you wanna call it right now, it's a SPAC. They will be holding hands together and going public and they will be changing the ticker name. But so far, this company's gonna be bigger and bigger and I feel like it should definitely become a giant. But so far, obviously, Tesla is way better. They have way more cars, they're way more established, they have a lot of software. It's more of like a EV software company than anything else. And Diamond Peak Holdings or Lordstown Motors has a long way to go before even considering becoming rivals with Tesla. But of course, this is a huge start and this is one of the few companies in the world in the EV department where they actually have a factory already set up and ready for the retrofitting process. That's about it. Thanks for watching and comment below.